All right, Mary Sue, you get it. You too, dog. All right, first we're going to start out with the Damien standard brush here, and we're just going to outline where we want the scales to go. Um, I've sped up the video, so I'm going to try to talk really fast and keep up with it. Uh, <laughs> then we use the Smooth Peaks brush, uh, which is a smooth brush, a uh, smooth option brush, uh, to smooth it out a little bit just at the front ends. And then we back, we uh, build up the back ends with the uh, clay, tool, clay tubes brush. Um, and then I use the... Uh, hard polish brush and the Damien Sander brush to define out the scales a little bit more, all trying to like make them look like they go underneath each other. Um, you can even hit the back end with the, uh, the um, hard polish brush as well. All right, and then I'm just going through here and using the Damien Sander brush again to make like little veins on the uh, uh, scales and to dig them in a bit more. Um, this is a Dynamesh, so uh, it'll just be like Dynameshing off the side here. And then, okay, uh, now I'm masking by cavity and I'm pulling with the move standard rush just little bits out to give a little irregularity and to pump up the uh, scaliness of it um, and then I'm using again the smooth peaks brush to just smooth it out it'll just leave like little crevices uh, you can kind of see them right there and uh, so then I'm going back through again with the Damien standard brush and the hard polish I'll pretty much go back and forth between those and and redefine things as they kind of develop within the uh, scales um, Again, I don't really know everything that's going to look at the end, uh, so I just like to sort of keep it loose and, and pull out stuff as, as it comes along. All right, again, I'm just continuing with the hard brush, a uh, little dynameshing right there, to read it, and then I'll go back and redefine. Pretty much do that again and again and again. And then here, I just want to show you guys a little bit in model uh, 